Hello there, friends. Welcome back to Retro. I hope you're all having an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on what time of day it is for you. So, <laughs> so we didn't have any luck with the tarantula the other night, and I'm I'm honestly a little bit disappointed. Not gonna lie, a little bit sad. Um, but you know what? From what I've read, it's a pretty rare find anyway. Um, we're gonna keep trying, and again, whether or not I get it on stream or off stream. I'm not really fussed as long as I catch it. <laughs> um, or I say on stream a lot. I'm sorry. I mean on camera. I'm very used to streaming. Um, we're going to hang out in retro today. Maybe I'll skip some time later and see if I can't find it. Um, I have a lot of uploads to do today, so I kind of got nothing better to do than to record. But I'm also kind of here for it. I have been really, really enjoying the city folks recently. Um, all right. What did we get? What is this? I'm also gonna note, I don't think I mentioned it yesterday. I don't know if the tarantula makes like scuttle scuttle noises like it does in New Leaf and other games, but I kept hearing the fountain in this area and kept panicking yesterday. <laughs> it was not fun. Or sorry, not yesterday, day before. Uh, all right. Letters from Samson. Samson moved out, unfortunately. Yo, Crystal Day is my last day in retro. Best thing I did here was be buds with you. I might be sweating in a different gym, but I'll always be lifting for you. Oh, he was a sweetheart. I had nothing against him. Uh, for, oh, wow, 40, 42K, geez. <laughs> oh, and hey, listen, our model room got a theme. It's sophistication. Come check it out. I am good. Maybe one day I will actually go look at it, but I'm, 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 under, I'm never too fast. <laughs> Um, okay, so I kind of have just like this collection of stuff. Uh, I'm gonna sell these. I'm gonna put that away if I don't already have it. Let's go see. And apologies ahead of time. My kitty cat Ollie is in here with me. He's not usually while I record, um, but he might not be feeling too well today. So he's kind of in here just, what am I doing? Uh, hanging out. And if you hear any weird noises, just assume that's him. There we go. Okay, good. It was new. That's awesome. Um, so other than perfect town, of course, that is like our overarching goal for this playthrough. Um, I was reading up online about something very interesting. So we need to raise, I think it's one million bells to get our hands on the last town upgrade, which is either the um, the windmill or the lighthouse. And funny enough, my guy doesn't mention this, but online people seem to think it actually does make a difference here. Um, there were some people saying that the windmill increases your town rating and the lighthouse um, brings in more rare fish. Right, and that sounds like it could be plausible. It also sounds like it might not be, um, which is why I'm so interested, if I'm honest. Uh, I heard also some people being like, no, you know, the windmill um, brings in rare bugs and the lighthouse brings in rare fish. And I'm like, okay, yeah, I could see that too. I'm not sure which. I think I kind of like both. I like the look of the windmill personally, but I also like the retro-ness of the lighthouse because of course in Animal Crossing GameCube, we had the lighthouse. Um, so I think I might just let you guys decide. I might just let you guys decide closer to the time because we are so far away from earning that amount. Um, and we'll do like a little poll or something, maybe. Uh, okay, I need... I need trees. Thank you. We should check our, our nook points sometime here soon. I haven't bothered checking in the longest time. We did have a, I think... Was it double or five time point day yesterday? Of course, I didn't sign on. <laughs> of course I didn't sign on, I was a little bit busy. There we go. Get all these, we will get that perfect town. I have to admit though, well, you know what? I was gonna say, I feel like this has been the hardest perfect town to get so far. Um, But my first time getting in New Leaf, it felt like it took a long time. Because I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> I'll take it, thank you. Uh, and question of the day while I'm buying these, by the way, it's the same question of the day I asked on stream today. 
um, for Nintendo's next console. This could be handheld, home console, or a bit of both, like the Switch. Uh, what would you like to see? Is there any um, specs, maybe? Do you want backwards compatibility? Do you want a certain look? What do you want? I think backwards compatibility is my most wanted feature. I don't know if Nintendo still sees it as profitable. Wow, I had the exact amount of pocket space I needed for that. <laughs> I don't know if Nintendo still sees backwards compatibility as profitable. Because I know as a kid, it was one of the reasons my mom was actually really chill with me getting Nintendo. Because she knew if I got the newer generation, I could still play my older games on it. So like, my, S my Game Boy Advance SP could also play my Game Boy Color games, or... Uh, my original DS could play my GBA games, so on and so forth, right? Um, but with the Switch, that wasn't really a thing, because they switched, like... Oh, oh, do you see what I see? Excuse me? No, no. I need, I need, I need, I need. Gimme, gimme, gimme. It is a very important item. Fine. Thank you. I was, <laughs> I was actually hoping I'd get one of these soon. Uh, I think I already have the arcade machine. Or pinball machine, sorry. Uh, so we're good. We're good. Um, but yeah, like, maybe Nintendo is of the mindset of like, oh, if we have them have a subscription, they can pay for their old games. And it's like, yeah. Yeah, I guess that's probably the way they're gonna go, but I still kind of would like to be able to not have to buy all of my Switch games all over again, because I have quite a collection these days. I, uh... After the Wii U, I didn't want to have, essentially, an overpriced paperweight like my Wii U is. <laughs> um... So I went all out and I, I got a lot of, uh... A lot of Switch games. See, I know I had that arcade machine. Uh, okay, so <laughs> this room is just chaos. And we're gonna add a little froggy to the chaos. Perfect. Alrighty, so... Um, oh, you know what? Actually, I'll put away the trees here really quick and then I'll go find an acre that I haven't put flowers in yet. I think I've covered actually almost all of them. I'm getting very close at least, which is great because then I only have to really worry about the trees. Um, oh, there you go. There you go. And there you go. Alrighty, um... Okay, acre. Without flowers. So this acre's covered. Uh, I know this one is covered down here. Uh, I can water these while we're walking by. Still no hybrids, by the way. At least not since the last time I signed on. That I know of. But we also haven't lost any more. <laughs> So, like, you know, that's that's a pretty good pretty good place to be. Uh, this acre has plenty, because we have around the museum. Uh, that acre is uh, good. This one... Oh, Samson. That makes me a bit sad. I wonder if we got anyone new. Uh, this acre is good. Let's see. This one's good. Oh, my main man is here. Hi. It has been... You're floating a little bit, buddy. You're floating a little bit. <laughs> it's been a minute. Man, breathing air feels pretty good. Hey, can I share something with you? Um, okay. Parents once worried about being parents, man. Cut him some slack. Dude, you just blew my mind. Oh, he made me sneeze. 
I'm sorry, I usually like to follow right after him, but he made me sneeze there. You just hanging out, bot? I think this is one of the uh, best routes I've ever seen him on, actually. Look at him go! Off on a big adventure. Stealing people's scallops. Delivering deep truths. <laughs> okay, uh, oh, hello. Go, another fossil. Oopsies. You just gonna go hang out under the branch? Yes, he is. <laughs> That's cute. I really enjoy seeing him. He's just a sweetheart. Uh, okay. Water these. And I have to pick some fruit here, especially... Especially because I really do want to get that lighthouse. Or windmill. I'm indifferent, like I said. Um... But I think I want to finish paying off our home loan first. We're actually not that far off. I've been pretty good about, you know, taking a good chunk of bells every now and then and paying it down. Oh, hello. Man, <laughs> I really want another four-leaf clover. Is that too much to ask? That's probably a lot to ask. Um. But yeah, I want to finish paying off our house and then all of our bells can go towards that town fund. Oh, this area is so empty. Uh, I think this area, yeah, this acre was covered. I think I actually may have covered all the acres. This one's covered. Um, oh, wait a minute. No, no, right here. Right here. Might be the last little batch of flowers. And I will, like, you know when we get perfect town i'm gonna redistribute these i want to kind of line them around our little paths and stuff um it's just for now this helps me see it's like okay yes we have you know x amount of flowers in this acre so we have the correct amount uh okay we're good here let's go say hello i don't think i've really said hi to anyone yet Super C, welcome, welcome. This is so like hop. Hey, Super C, look, I'm totally wearing imported clothes today. They're designed by someone named Scott over in Tree Hut. Man, those people from Tree Hut constantly uh, stealing my thunder with my rainbow shirt. Okay, uh, we have one more batch of flowers to water. So let's head up there and do that. I've also not found our last fossil for today yet. Here we go. Oh, and this acre is actually done. This is the most recent one I've worked on. It looks pretty good. Very happy with this. And again, I'm I'm being kind of methodical with this and it's not really placing trees where they're gonna look good. It's more so where I know they're gonna work. Um, so once we get perfect town, I might just chop it all and, and try to make proper paths and stuff like that. We'll see. We'll see how we're doing. Um, but I kind of like that idea. I don't mind actually keeping perfect town after we get the the golden um, golden watering can. <laughs> Well, I'll be, dearie. Aren't you brave walking right into the lion's den? This room is stuffed with all my favorite, uh, stuff. Hang on, as long as you like, just don't touch my stuff. I will not touch your stuff, don't you worry. Your stuff, not touched. Oh, hi. What are you doing hiding? Oh, now I'm in a pickle. I seem to have lost the key to my house. Oh, that's why you're hiding. <laughs> I was strolling along the river a little earlier. If I drop my key there, I may be locked out of my marvelous abode forever. I'll never be able to nibble tuna casserole while dancing myself to soul music. 
or by myself, sorry. Okay, I got you. I can work on that. Actually, one of these days, I tend to sign on, obviously, after stream. Um, I stream from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. usually. Oopsies. Uh, most days. So, obviously, if you haven't already noticed, most of my episodes take place after around, like, 4-ish. Um, but I have a lot of stuff I need to catch that comes out in the morning. So one one day I either got to record or sign on early. Um, but I was going to say, I'm missing the guppy still, and I know that stops coming out after 4. And I was about to be like, oh, you know, I'll search for the guppy while searching for your house key. And then I, I realized what time it was. <laughs> see here oh you know what i found the other night it was while i was searching for the um for the tarantula but i actually stumbled across i think it's the goliath beetle on a palm tree uh it's one of the beetles at least that is on the island in new leaf during the summer it's a summer bug i remember that much <laughs> um i accidentally scared it away which sucks um but it was still kind of cool to see, and I actually like ran right into the tree. I just kind of missed my shot with the net, which is what spooked it. Um, but that was kind of neat. But we caught a lot, you know, we, we caught a lot of stuff that I might not have otherwise found. Okay, these are far too big to be house keys, I think, but I'll still catch them anyway. Oh, you know what I haven't done yet? I meant to do it for like May and I completely forgot. I ordered in the AC and it, or, okay, I can't do the abbreviation. The City Folk <laughs> guidebook like forever ago now. And I keep mentioning it. I was gonna start showing off the calendar at the beginning of each month. So I'm gonna post that on screen somewhere here. I'm sorry if it's a crappy picture. Um. I don't think there was a lot going on in June, at least for my region, from what I remember seeing. Oh, this might be the key. Um, I think it might be, is it July or August when the fireworks start? I think it might be August. I'm kind of excited for that. I always liked fireworks in Animal Crossing. It's one of my favorite, just like musics and musics, music and events. Okay, you are not a house key, you are actually a fish. Have you guys ever gotten locked out of your house? I remember one day I forgot to bring my key. And like, I would leave before my mom in the morning so she locked up. And uh, I came home after school and I couldn't get in and it was raining. And I got drenched. I was so... Ooh, what are you? Oh, that's the chard! Nice! Okay, yes. Yes. I'm sorry that I got very excited, but that is exciting. Yes, I have been looking for you, sweetheart. Um, but yeah, I got drenched. It sucked. <laughs> it sucked. Um, thankfully, I'm pretty good about remembering my keys and stuff these days, but... When I was younger, I was pretty... I mean, I'm still pretty forgetful, but... I try to make a mental note before I leave the house sort of dealio. Uh, rainbow trout. I think I've caught that one. I don't have my list up in front of me. Nope. <laughs> I'm sorry. Now that I've caught something I need to donate, I do not talk to villagers because I know you're going to try to take it from me. Because you always do. That is a really big fish. What are you? Aw, oh, man, I was just, just a smidge too late on that one. Ugh. Oh. Oh, it's just a bug in the water. Okay. That's acceptable. That's fine. I'm sorry to run away from you, sweetheart. I just really don't want you to ask because I feel guilty saying no. And, uh, I can't handle having virtual animals be mad at me, let alone real people. Uh, 
Okay, we're not gonna make that before it goes over the edge here. That's okay, we'll catch you on the other side. We get a lot of balloons recently. I got a lot uh, yesterday when I was running around trying to find the, uh, the tarantula. That might be the house key right there. Hopefully. I did want to go to the city today. There we go. All right, what do we got? Oh, yep, here we go. One up, mushroom. I'll take it. No, no, you, you go back in that letter. Thank you. There we go. Hello? Husky? Please don't have gone under the bridge. Oh, you did, didn't you? Gosh darn it. Okay. Oh, he's actually out and about again. That's nice. He's been... Oh god. <laughs> he's been really, really sick recently. It's nice to actually see him outside. I feel like he's been in for uh, quite a long time here. Seriously, where is this house key? I'm not having much luck here. I might go inside really quick and try to uh, reset the spawns. All right, fingers crossed this works. I know in... New Leaf I always felt like it worked and actually yesterday what I was doing was I was entering and leaving uh, Monty's place repeatedly and walking up here to see if the tarantula would spawn. Never saw one. I never even heard one I don't think. Um, but I figured it was- oh there that might be it. Uh, I figured it was worth a try. I think the thing getting me is I don't really know how the spawns in this game work if it's like uh, new leaf or not. I'm not even gonna bother trying to get that out from under the bridge, by the way. <laughs> not worth it. It probably is that, though. <laughs> it probably is. Goodness me, where is this house key though? Where have you gotten off to? I don't think I've ever had this bad luck with this. If I don't find it here on another lap, I might uh, just head over into the city and uh, do this after. No, no, you notice me. You come back here. You're not gonna okay. And by the time I change the other side, you're gonna flip to this side, aren't you? Oh wait a minute, wait a minute. Don't you don't 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 <laughs> please come back. I just want to know what you are. I think I have something for around here. Mm, no. <laughs> you wasted so much time just now. You're lucky I can't cook in this game. Uh, okay. Well, you know what? was my pocket full of fish and my pocket full of trash including that one fish um no i'm joking uh let's head into the city i want to get some artwork i want to see a show i will find that house key off camera
Alrighty, here we are. Oh, we do got some cuties here today, though. Look at these cuties. Um, let's go see if Red has anything new. I don't remember the last time I came to see him, so he might not have anything. No, he's still sold out. Alright, you know what? Fair. Fair. When did I see him? Was it on the first? Might have been on the first. Um, how about we go to a show then? Oh, Portia! Oh, Stitch! Oh my goodness, the cuties. I say this every time. <laughs> Just all of them. Cuties. I feel like it's been a while since we did this. Um, uh, disappointment. I don't think I've already seen this. No, I have disbelief. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I've already seen this one. Oh, there's no one else in here. Wow, that's weird. Thank you for your patience, everyone! The Marquis is pleased to welcome Dr. Shrunk, starring in the feature presentation, Disappointment. Thank you, thank you, and thank you! Dr. Shrunk is in the house. Um, so, I once got some advice from a respected man at the theater. He said, Shrunk! You'll never be a hit in a million years if you mumble all the time. And I've always belted out my gags ever since. Not that it helps. Doctor is out. And there he goes. I don't know if I like his jokes better in... Um... In New Leaf or not. Okay. Um... Let's get rid of realization for this one. There we go. I haven't seen the other guy. I think you can see him occasionally, right? This one? I don't actually know. I don't think I've ever had a, a show with him. Unless that's the first one you see. I don't think it is. But I might be misremembering also. Okay. Do we have a Bob out here who I can steal? I mean, well, I mean, we got a Kiki. I can settle for a Kiki. I do like Kiki. Alrighty, anyways, um, I'm gonna wrap up here. Thank you guys so, so very much for watching. I am gonna probably work on uh, selling off some more fruit, working on our home loan, um, and probably also do some bug catching and stuff tonight. So I'm gonna hopefully keep my recording software open. If I end up catching the tarantula, I will hopefully capture it in a recording as well. So I'll and put that here somewhere. Either way, thank you all so, so very much for watching. Have an amazing rest of your day, and hopefully I will see you all in the next one.